Welcome back to PlayOnSports.com and our player of the game here again. Uh, Tonkowitz winning by a final score of 51-7. Benjamin Moreno here with three touchdown passes, two connected to Michael Stewart. First time, we had to mention this, first time ever that this school has won five games in one season. Now we talked about this either, but really, how does it feel to finally be that, this this team to finally go over the hump? Feels great. I mean, uh, we're getting our team together. We got a brotherhood going, and I mean, it feels good. Uh, you talk about a team that, you know, last year finishing 2-8, and eight, and uh, a, a team that, as you look at the standings, yeah, you're 5-1, and one, but the, the real big thing you see on the standings is you jump 150 slots in the southern section. You guys are in the middle of the pack in the southern section, one of the best teams in uh, in Division 8, one of the best teams in, in, uh, in just in your area, too, and, you know, you've got, you guys have faced some really good competition, you know, taking on Miriam Mesa, only losing by 13 to Mecula Valley at a Division 2. I mean, what... I mean, how do you guys just keep that, that, that flow going in week after week? Our coaches, every time we, after a win, they tell us, I mean, we had a good game, but look to the next one. I mean, that's what we're looking at week by week. We don't look ahead. We don't look back. It's just take one game at a time. And how about yourself, too? Because, uh, you know, you really, I know we mentioned a lot of Jonte Price, and, you know, we try to, you know, mention a lot of you more, a lot you of, of, of you guys here throughout the games. But today was really a team effort, especially offensively, too. Michael Stewart getting two top pa touchdown passes out of your, out of your arm, who, you threw for, uh, for three. The running game did very well. The defensive uh, output was phenomenal today. I, I mean, I mean, do you feel like this might have been one of your best games uh, uh, this season so far? Uh, yeah, I can. I mean, it's a crosstown rivalry. We, us coming over here and doing this on their field, I mean, it feels great. I mean, the defense, we watched film all week, and we know what we could do. And just handing the ball off to Jonte and then throwing it in the air, I mean, it felt great. And, and you know, talk about the league too. Obviously, one and zero to start league play, and obviously, uh, Hemet don't want to take away from them. Obviously, one of the the, the lower teams in uh, in this league. But the rest of the season, you guys are facing some very tough competition, and it's very unique. Only because, you know, you've seen these teams week in and we uh, year in and year out, and it's obviously different competition compared to what you guys see in in, long, in non league. Uh, what changes have you guys made so far so that you guys can be much more competitive? Uh, going in week in a week, week out when you guys start a league play? Uh, just keep working hard. I mean, go to practice, stay focused. I mean, game plan. I mean, we, we've got our teams coming up. We've got other rivals coming up, and we're just ready. And obviously, we talked about this too. Hemet last week, they did beat you guys on your home field and, uh, you know, finally take it to it this week. And, I mean, you know, it is kind of in a way you can say a cross on rival, only one street separating you guys. I mean, how does it feel to, to not only start the season 1-0, but, you know, beat a really uh, a tough team like Hemet? Yeah, it felt great. I mean, last year they did catch us on our home field, but uh, it feels good to come back and get some revenge. So uh, our good guy in Benjamin Moreno here, our, our PlayOnSports.com player of the game, three touchdown passes here tonight as they won it by a final score of 51-7. to From all of us here on Play on Sports. this is Manny Nunez. We'll see you next week for Talkwitz as they will take on San Jacinto in their second game of Mountain Pass League play. Signing off here, we'll see you back next week.